always be contented. Once, a businessman was strolling on a beach. He saw a fisherman returning to the seashore after catching few big fish. Hey fisherman, how long does it take you to catch so many fish? Well, not too long, just a short while. Then why don't you stay longer at sea and catch even more fish? Even more fish? But what do I do with all that fish? This is enough to feed my whole family. Hmm. So what do you do rest of the day then? I usually wake up early in the morning. I go out to the sea and catch a few fish. Then I go back home and play with my kids. In the afternoon, I take a nap. And when evening comes, I join my buddies in the village for a cup of coffee. We play guitar together, we sing and dance and we make merry. Hmm, that's a quite simple and I should say boring life. Listen, I am a PhD in business management. You know what? I have an idea for you. I can help you to become a more successful person. And you have the potential. Oh, really? What would I have to do for that? Hear me out carefully. From now on, spend more time at sea and try to catch as many fish as possible. More time at sea? But what would I do with all the fish that I catch then? So once you catch more fish, then you can make more money. And once you have more money, you can buy a bigger boat and catch even more fish. Well, what would I do with even more fish then? Hey, then you can afford to buy even bigger boats. And you know what? After that, once you become really big, you can set up your own company. You can install your own production plant and you can sell canned food. You can set up a distribution network. Oh, really? Do you think I can do all that? But I wonder what would I do after I set up all that business? Then you don't have to stay any longer in the village. You can move on to a big city. You can set up your company's headquarters in a metropolitan and from there you can manage your entire business empire. Well, that sounds interesting in a big city. But what do I do after I become so rich? Hey, then you can live life like a king. You know what? You can make it even bigger. You can go public. You can float your company's shares in the stock exchange and then you will just not have enough time to even count the money you will be making. I've been poor all my life, but what do people do when they get so rich? Oh, I can't imagine you're not getting so excited about it. It is going to be so fantastic. You know what? Once you have this much money, you can then happily retire. You can come out of the polluted city, settle down in a serene, quiet little fishing village, go every morning to do a little bit of fishing, in the afternoons, play with your kids, take a short nap. In the evenings, meet your buddies and then make merry over song and dance. What a fantastic life it's going to be. <laughs> That's true, but isn't that what I'm already living right now? Oh, really? Is it? Moral Bhagwan Baba says that peace and happiness are present in contentment. A contented person is the richest and the one with many desires is the poorest. Let us have a limit on our desires and make our joy limitless. <laughs>